<laughs> You're in luck because we asked a sports therapist and she gave us some insightful information on how to help neck pain. The two biggest reasons for neck pain on the bike. Number one, improper sunglasses. If you have sunglasses, and this is for those cyclists who are riding in the hoods or the drops, if you're upright, you're good with really any sunglasses. But if you're down in this position, and this is too thick on your sunglasses, this top part, what's gonna happen is, when you're looking down on the road, you're not gonna be able to see under like a really thick part of your sunglasses. So you're gonna tilt your head back like this. And so your cycling position will end up here just to get underneath your sunglasses or the top part of it. Now the problem with that is it compresses the neck joints called the facets. So this turns into a joint compression in your neck that can be really painful. And then one day you wake up and you've slept and you can't even turn your head. These are all facet joint impingements that can be avoided by starting to make sure that you have good sunglasses or you have good vision that when you look down the road, you can keep your neck, it's gonna be a little tilted, but more neutral than this. So if you can get here, you still see, are looking up ahead, that's gonna be a safe position for you to ride and a safe position for your spine. The second biggest reason for neck pain on the bike is actually mid-back mobility. For those of us who are hunched over, this is called a thoracic kyphosis. This has to do with posture, everyone. Posture, posture, posture. Once you end up in this position, maybe you sit there, maybe you stand there, you're definitely gonna be on the bike there. And if you're hunched over, and again, you're down in the hoods or the drops, you're actually, even if you have the best sunglasses, you're gonna have to tip your head back because the curve in your back is so significant. You wanna be able to actually work on extending your mid back, and you can do that with a foam roll, but think reverse the curve. So you could be over a foam roll and just lie over it wherever the ribs attach and then extend backwards so that way you start opening up the spine. You can get a better spinal alignment on the bike and then you don't have to crank your head back so far.